hello guys welcome back i actually planned to shoot this video on a saturday but I came home on friday night and i was like i have some time so why not why not just start with my you know, the whole routine and honestly i've never done a pre-pool so i tried i thought of doing a pre-pool this time around before shampooing my hair so i'm going to be using this oil mix you know I don't know if you've seen me use this bottle before, but it was in this. I poured it into this, what is it called? Applicator bottle I got from Adobel Concepts, which is still available. It's only 80, so check out her page and get yourself one. You see me use it, so you know how to use it. But it's, I just wanted to mention that it's a mixture of oils, okay? Adobel Concepts also sells Hermani oils. So I mix these three oils, which are very good. You know, I will just put a list of the benefits of using these. This, uh, this is rose hip oil. Rose hip oil. Um, we have tea tree oil, and then we have sweet almond. Sweet almond oil. Okay. So, and I added just a little bit of Jamaican black castor oil. So what I did was. Um, I use I use this oil actually for my skin every day and also for um, my hair normally these oils you can't use them um, you can't use them as they are they always have to be mixed with what they call a carrier oil so you can choose olive oil or coconut oil or a heavier oil I'm not sure of what I'm saying but I think that you can't just pour else of course you'll get finished so I mix mine with coconut oil these three oils plus the Jamaican black castor oil with my own personal <laughs> personal like I did it myself with coconut oil that I took from someone's kitchen so yes yeah. so what I'm going to do is heat up this in a kettle I've already boiled the water in the kettle so I'm just going to put it inside the hot water it's already boiled I'm not going to boil it again so I'm just going to sit inside the hot water and then I will let it get hot as I section my hair up and wait okay so let's do this well hello so I remove my hair I get my okay yeah really dry get my water spray bottle oh my clips first actually <laughs> yeah just so that i can partition it well then i spread it all around my hair to make it flexible spread 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 all around massage it into okay hi guys before i start detangling i want to talk about this flexible detangling brush which is actually a knockoff of the original one but it does the same job the only disadvantage is this one does not come with the stiffener at the back so you you can't determine when you want to have a, a, a solid or stiff brush but it works the same as the other like i've used the other one before anyway so yeah this is so that adobe concepts do at only 20 to 22 galaxies i'm not too sure but check out her page it's very very Good. I will demonstrate how it's used and how easy it is to actually detangle your hair with this, you know, brush. So we yeah, are. Let's get into this. Okay, so here I am, sectioning up my hair. What I'll be doing is um, dividing into six, dividing it into six sections: three on one side and three on the other side. I really hate sectioning my hair because <laughs> it's the most annoying part of the whole routine when your hair is the most tangled up and you have to use your fingers to create parts and stuff yeah very annoying but you saw before I did that I spritz a little bit of water just to make my hair a little soft did I did I spritz any water I don't even know huh anyways so yeah but out out um advice you spread some water just so your hair gets a little soft and then you can easily i mean it'll be easier than not using any water at all So 
so i'm done with all my six parts yay we're going on to applying the oil so i take down the first part spritz a little water in fact spritz a lot of water actually a lot and then use my fingers to you know rake through my hair pull out the ends first as i always do i'd rather pull out the ends first because that's where all the you know the ends are always shrunken up into each other that's where most of the tangles are anyways so pull out the hair with your hands before you start finger detangling or even before you start using a brush to detangle your hair yep here i am with my flexible brush see how easy it is guys so easy so easy and I didn't even finger detangle much. That's the funny thing about it. Normally when you're, I don't know for other naturals, but whenever I'm detangling my hair, I have to really finger detangle. If I'm going to use a brush, I have to make sure I really finger detangle before I use a flick, um, any brush at all. But I didn't really finger detangle. And see how easy it was for the brush to move through. Of course, I started at the ends. So I'm not going up yet, but here I am applying more oil because of course it's a hot oil treatment and also be careful about the hot oil because it can get hot when i started it burned my scalp a little so be careful when you're applying it or let it cool down just a little bit before you start using it so yeah i apply a lot of the oil rake it through my hair and then use the brush look at it look at it look at how easy it is how easy it is guys anyways yeah. i recommend every natural gets a brush like this honestly honestly i think everyone has a brush anyway so why not use one that will help you or prevent too much breakage and stuff so here i am twisting up my hair i'm done with the section so yeah that's about it so i'm just going to be moving pretty fast from here on it's going to be fast forwarded because you've seen how one was done obviously that's how you do all the rest of it so enjoy the video Hey guys, so I'm done with everything. It looks like what's her name? What's her name? The woman with the snakes on her head. Also <laughs> in Medusa. Yeah, anyway, so yeah, I'm done with my six parts. Finished detangling my hair. So I'm just going to apply some of the oil to my scalp and massage it in as you see me doing. Here we go. Guys, you know how messy an oil um, treatment can get, you know, but this didn't get too messy because I was using an applicator bottle. So I'd advise that everyone gets one. It's cheap. There's one that has only one nozzle. It's six CDs from Adobe Concepts. And what I'm using right now is just eight CDs. So 
get yourself one okay i'll just link it ig below so you get yourself one it helps mm -hmm. so yeah covering my hair with a shower cap and then my bonnet and i go off to sleep thanks for watching bye